Raja must be overwhelmed with all these Telugu people around him. But this is not new to him. He comes to our Balaji Temple in Chicago every Sunday without fail. And I think Lord Balaji has blessed him with the honor of being the congressman from the 8th Congressional District of Illinois. He is very cordial, very congenial, and very much involved in the communities of the Chicago area. I welcome Sri Raja Krishnamurti to come and address you for a couple of minutes and then we'll start the award ceremony. He will be giving the awards to all the recipients. I invite another Raja, Surapaneni from St. Louis to welcome him with a bouquet. He's the regional coordinator for South Central Region from St. Louis. One Raja honoring the other Raja. Namaste, Bhavanara. I am honored to be here. My name is Raja Krishnamurthy. And everywhere I go in Illinois, I get asked a question, which is, what the heck does Raja Krishnamurthy mean? Where did you get that funny name? What does it mean? So I say it's very simple. Translated from an ancient Indian language, it means Congressman for the 8th District of Illinois. I was sworn in in Washington, D.C. on January 3rd. On that day, my eight-year-old said to me, so today is your swearing-in day, isn't it? I said, yes, it is. And he said, what bad words will you be saying today? Today is not a day for bad words. Today is a day for good words. Today is a day for blessed words and beautiful words. And I am so honored to be here, and thank you so much uncle for that beautiful introduction i want to honor the three rules of public speaking be short be sweet and be gone and so i only have three points to make today first point congratulations to Tana on its 40th anniversary and a big congratulations to dr jampala and the entire leadership team of Dana. Can you give them a big round of applause? Second point, I'd like you to give yourselves a big round of applause for everything that you do every day in every way for your community and this country. I can't hear you. You see like my family, you came to this country with nothing, nothing. But you brought culture, you brought your values, you brought your education, and you brought your work ethic. And you worked tirelessly day and night. Day and night to put food on the table, to put food on the table for your families, a roof over their heads. You educated your beautiful children, and now look at you. You are a success in the greatest country the world has ever known, the United States of America. And you are the pride of one of the greatest civilizations the world has ever known, India. And so I stand on your shoulders to reach for the stars and to be in the United States Congress. So I thank you. I thank you from the bottom of my heart for everything that you do every day. So give yourselves a big round of applause. Third and final point, third and final point. You know, we're going through a slightly turbulent period in our country. I never thought that Srinivas Kuchibotla would be murdered in cold blood. I never thought I would be the first member of the United States Congress to call on the Attorney General to investigate murder and to bring the full force of the United States government to bear on solving why this happened. But, on the other hand, 
Look at what you did. You as a community in Thana stepped up to help the families of the victims. You stepped up to fight him. And Ian Grillet stepped up to help at a time when he did not have to do so. You've heard of the term evangelical Christian. I respect them. I happen to be an evangelical American. From my bully pulpit in the United States Congress, I teach the values of freedom, liberty, equality, hard work, and prosperity. And if you believe in those values, you are not American. It doesn't matter the color of your skin. It doesn't matter where you came from. It doesn't matter how you dress. It doesn't matter how you pray. And it certainly doesn't matter how many letters there are in your name. There are 18 in mine. All that matters is this. Do you live a life of character? Do you raise your children right? Do you work hard and play by the rules and do you try to give a little something back to your community and country? Because if you do, you are an American. And we will stand shoulder to shoulder, everyone in this room, with those of you who want to pursue your place in America and your peaks of the American dream. I am proud to be Indian American and I'm proud to be Hindu American and I'm most of all As I took the oath on the Bhagavad Gita, I said to myself, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. Because you are the greatness of America. You are the greatness of America. And let us not ever forget that. So I close with my favorite saying, yesterday's history, tomorrow's a mystery, but today's gift. That's why we call it the present. And so I am honored and blessed to be with you here today in St. Louis to celebrate Tana, to celebrate your families, to celebrate the future of our country and how together we are going to make America a better place. So God bless you, God bless your families, God bless Tana, and God bless the United States of America. Thank you so much. We will now start the award ceremony. The first set of awards are for excellence in their own fields or in service of multiple other avenues of life. So the first award recipient is a young person. You might have seen him in this great movie, Growing Up Smith. It was just released recently, Roni Akurati. Please come on up here. He's an emerging young Hollywood star and a stand-up comedian. He played the lead role, lead role in the film Growing Up Smith and got rave reviews. Daily Herald praised him for his funny and engagingly sincere performance. He performs at Hollywood Improv Theatre. He also played the main character Mowgli in Disney's stage production Jungle Book. He landed TV roles also in Animal Practice on ABC, another period with Ben Stiller on Comedy Central, and Dead Time Stories and Henry Danger on Nickelodeon. Congratulations, Roni. Great job. Hollywood, here we come. Roni and it's a kid pergada. Oro Payanoche, Korane, Babuni, parent and Edgar. Prasa than the Anad. Put to Prasa than I come on the Anad. Aya Milan, Panukman, Lugadu, Reclan, Prasal, and Thurani, Mamma, where I went to such a Nara and Avara Prasa than Betty than the Anad. Tarwata, Drew Repa. He is from Normal, Illinois. He gets an award for science and technology. He won multiple prestigious awards like Limca Book of Records 2016, Youngest Ham Radio Operator in the World from Indian Origin in 2015. He won several tournaments and he is involved in the school 
is involved in a program called ARIS, NASA School Program, which involves the school students to talk with astronauts on International Space Station from ground using ham radio program. Dhruv Reba. ఇప్పుడు ఇందాక కన్వీనర్ గారు చెప్పినట్లు టౌన్ అండ్ కంట్రీ వాస్తవ్యులు డాక్టర్ సుబ్బారావు పోలినేని డాక్టర్ పోలినేని సుబ్బారావు మీ అందరికీ చిరపరిచితులై ఉంటారు ఈజ్ ఎ హ్యాండ్ సర్జన్ ఫ్రమ్ సెయింట్ లూయిస్ ఈ ఫౌండెడ్ ఎ వండర్ఫుల్ ఆర్గనైజేషన్ ఆల్ ద బ్రైట్ లైఫ్ ఫౌండేషన్ సుబ్బారావు గారు It runs a free residential school called Sri Sarada Niketan Public School for Orphans, street children, impoverished children including HIV infected children in a village called Martu, Prakasham district, Andhra Pradesh. He started the school in 2009 with all his retirement funds. life savings and donations from the St. Louis Telugu community. The school is now up and running with about 300 children from kindergarten to 12th grade. For the last four years, the 10th grade students achieved a 100% pass. This is not just a charity school, it's an excellent school for education. 100% pass in their final exam. Last year, 16 out of the 37 students scored 90% or above in their 10th finals exam. Some of the students participated in international math olympiad and won five gold medals and 13 gold medals this year. Almost 90% of the school's needs are grown in the campus. They're very green. They use solar power panels and biogas plant for cooking gas and has its own dairy farm. Currently, he's a cancer survivor and is a liver transplant recipient. He spends countless hours and immense time and energy for this noble cause. He is 71 years old and goes to work to the hospital every single day to earn a paycheck which is spent to meet the needs of these 300 needy kids. Please give them a round of applause. <laughs> Dr. Paul and Andy Sikharov. Tom Brokaw, the famous anchor person, said, it's easy to make a buck, it's very hard to make a difference. So Dr. Subaro has proved in our lifetime that it's easy to make a difference. Our second recipient, Sri Venkat Ishwar Rao Mandava, he is also well known to most of you from St. Louis. He hails from Bloomington, Normal, Illinois. He's getting an award for leadership and community service. He has been serving the community tirelessly and consistently since he came to the United States 15 years ago. He is serving as the chairman of the Human Relations Commission of Normal. Since 2009, he is engaged in reviewing and resolving citizen discrimination complaints and participated in Not In Our Town organization to prevent racism. He invited Arun Gandhi, the grandson of Mahatma Gandhi, as a keynote speaker at a luncheon program. He is the first person of Indian origin to be recognized and honored as Citizen of the Year 2016 by the city of Normal. He is elected chairman of Bloomington Normal Twin Cities MAP, Minority and Police Partnership, which is part of the city official boards and commissions. He has done extraordinary charitable work through Tana Team Square, Telugu Association of Bloomington, Seva International, 
ACOL, which runs single teacher schools in remote villages in India, and teaching yoga as a Sangh Chalak for Hindu Swayam Sevak Sangh. He is one of the directors and founding members of another charitable organization for Better Tomorrow, Sri Venkatesh Rao Mandava. Shaila Talu. Shaila is from St. John's, Florida. Donara, Shaila. She is being recognized for community service. Please come. She is a social entrepreneur, activist, poet, and an IT professional. Srimati Shaila lives in Jacksonville, Florida with her husband and two children. Founder of Pure, P U R E, People of for Urban and Rural Education. She focused on empowering underprivileged children through education. 4,200 children and 73 schools call pure their own in the two Telugu speaking states, receiving the gift of water, toilets, science labs, libraries, digital classrooms, and more. She is also the director of PGNF, Prakasham Global NRI Forum, another charitable organization focused by digitizing high schools. She is an advisor to Guiding Light Foundation and also a volunteer and sponsor Kasturba Gandhi Memorial Trust, which partners in sanitary napkin manufacturing, which was established as part of life skill training to abused and rescued women and girls. She is sponsoring orphans through Pure, Global Aid, Mayalu, and Spurti Foundations. She was very well recognized by several organizations and also by the Honorable Union Minister Sri Venka and Aydgar, Sri Mithi Shaila Talduri. And this happens to be her birthday also. Wish you a very happy birthday, Shaila. Keep up the good work. The next recipient is Sri Giridhar Sri Perumbudur. He is a community member, is a committee member for Chesterfield City, CCE, Citizens Committee for Environment, so supports and leads volunteer programs. As a director of community service leader Rican Cricket Academy, he, he, he heads community service projects for kids. In 2006, he was able to set up and participate in 12 service projects. He collected $5,340 for St. Patrick Center's Trevisano Teddy Bear Christmas Land. He is the recipient of Employee of the Month in September 2003. An agriculture research company, Monsanto, he is the Iron Man also, the bodybuilder, in 2006. Gary's community service and volunteer coaching was recognized in an article in his World Centric Group newsletter. Congratulations, Giridhar. The next recipient, I'm sure, is not here today, but I'd just like to read about him is Dr. Hari Kanjivaram. He is from Ann Arbor, Michigan, for medicine and community service. He is a professor of medicine in the Division of Gastroenterology, University of Michigan. His clinical research has been focused in the areas of viral hepatitis, non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. He won numerous awards for his mentoring, teaching of medical students, residents, and GI fellows, including the Marvin Pollard Award for outstanding teaching of residents. He coordinated multiple local and international medical relief missions to disaster-stricken areas of Haiti, Philippines, and most recently, Ecuador. He helped set up a free GI scope endoscopy unit at Sri Satyasai Institute of Higher Medical Sciences 
in Puttaparthi. He has won several awards for his community service, including the UM Teens Award for Community Service, Lotus Award, Shining Hero Award, and Leonard Taw Humanism in Medicine Award. Kanji Varam. The next recipient is Dr. Ramaya Muthiala. He is from Mendota Heights, Minnesota. Dr. Professor Ramaya is one of the outstanding scientists in the field of science, field of drug discovery and development of pharmaceuticals and fine chemicals. He developed the anti-epileptic drug via gabatrin used for refractory complex seizures. It's now available in many countries around the world. For the past 15 years, his research focused on developing therapeutics for rare diseases affecting approximately 90 million Indians, such as sickle cell disease, hemophilia, thalassemia, and rare blood cancers. He founded the Indian Organization for Rare Diseases, IORD, a year ago. He adopted a school for Teresa Mentally Challenged Rehabilitation School in Kamam, where more than 80 students with rare diseases are housed at any given time. Professor Ramaya was elected to the Fellow of Royal Society of Chemistry and Foreign Fellow of AP Academy Sciences. He has 18 patents and three provisional patents. Professor Ramaya. And the last recipient in this Awards for Excellence is Manmad Reba. Manmad. He's from San Diego, California, and he's getting an award for sports and fitness. He's the first Andhra person to finish the Ultraman Triathlon, which is considered the toughest test for human endurance. He has officially finished the 2017 Ultraman Florida with a time of 31 hours and 43 minutes to become the second Indian male in finishing Ultraman. This is a 321 mile race, which requires the participant to complete a six point mile swim, 263 mile bike ride, and 52.4 mile run to finish it. Out of 44 participants from 21 countries, he won the title, adding another feather in his glorious hat. Iron Man, he received the prestigious presidential award from Barack Obama in 2016 for tutoring homeless kids. Manmad Repa. Namaskar, Jai Hind. Uh, on behalf of uh, the government of India, our embassy of India in Washington, and on behalf of all the consulates of India in the US, let me extend my very warm greetings to all of you. Let me also congratulate Tana for its upcoming 40th birthday, for the 21st convention that you are having today. I am indeed deeply honored to be here, to be part of such grand festivities. This is by far one of the biggest events that I have attended. Many, many congratulations. Uh, as you heard, I have joined very recently in Chicago, a few months ago. But I am extremely impressed by the hard work, by the achievements of our community members, especially members of Tana. They are everywhere. You all are everywhere. Whether it is uh, an event for uh, cultural uh, activities, whether it's an economic event, whether it is some event to uh, help other people, charitable organizations. I see Tana members everywhere and I extend, I really congratulate you for all the commitment that you have shown to the community, to India. You have made remarkable achievements here. Your uh, successes in every possible field, whether it is politics, economics, IT, entrepreneurship, cultural, or any possible field I have seen are tremendous 
and at the same time you have maintained your roots with India, contributing in every possible way, uh, contributing in the development of the country, in the development of your motherland. I salute all of you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Mana Mana Matero, Indian Church in Gastronaro, I request Molopoli Babi Razo, Jeppy Chairman Master Gallery. You may begin with a plus. Also, we have a Chevrolet Basket at the MLA from Chattagiri. You may begin with a plus. Also, we have Pathur in Nagaboshana, Jeppy Chairman X from Gundur. Please come to the dance. Thank you all.